Hello guys. My eyes might be a little bit red because I just tried to take some sun selfies, but the sun is just, I can't anymore. My eyes have gotten a little bit lighter. Um, the more like veggies and fruits you eat and just a lot of things kind of change the color of your eyes sometimes. Um, but I'm noticing that my left eye is getting, sometimes I'm doing my makeup and it's getting like this like really beautiful hazel. I've always wanted hazel or green eyes. That's like my favorite. But I love the green that has like a little bit of brown in it. I don't like green green. Um, I love that hazely sort of green. But anyways, yeah, now I'm noticing, and of course the lighter your eyes get, um, the more harder it is to look at the sun. So I was just trying to take selfies and I seriously, I couldn't make it through one photo. It's just so sensitive. Now I know how Amy feels because every time we're taking sun selfies, I'm just there and I'm taking pictures and she's like, how are your eyes not burning? I'm like, they're not burning because they were darker before. I had super, super dark brown eyes. Even here, they look like they are, but not in the mirror anymore. Um, you guys might notice that I have a lot more blonde in my hair. So after I got my hair done, I absolutely, I loved it, loved, loved, loved it. But um, my only thing was that it wasn't enough blonde up here. So right now it's to the side part. Let me put it in the middle so that you guys can see. Let me fix this for you guys so that you guys can see what I'm kind of talking about. So before I felt like, as you guys can see now, I have less root and then more like lightness, more blonde coming down. Not super blonde up here, but just kind of coming down a little bit. And same with this side. So I felt like that was kind of missing. Um, and it's so hard for like your stylist to really understand what it is that you want and they don't want to do too much They don't want to do too little like I said. I absolutely love what she did I loved it and a part of me is like should I have kept that but the thing is this is gonna be growing out And I don't like to get my hair done too too often because it can just get really expensive um, So what I like to do is kind of go every couple months um, And now I'll only have to really see her around my birthday maybe just to add in a few more pieces but I just decided to go brighter. Um, I felt like there was still, oh yeah, and the major problem was when I put my hair up, like when I pulled it back like this, you couldn't see any blonde up here because they were kind of like this really dark honey caramel. Um, but now when I put it up, I have like blonde pieces coming through and I just like the movement of having a little bit of more lighter pieces. I'm like full on blonde right now, um, compared to the last time that you guys saw me. And now when it grows out, it's going to be exactly what I'm kind of looking for. But anyways, you guys, right now I am going to the gym. I am ready and all. Um, it's Sunday. I went to the gym yesterday and I usually don't like to go two days in a row just because my body can get very sore. But what I find if you guys have to go like day after day or if you guys can only go on the weekends. I've been going on the weekends now just because during the week I am super crazy with filming and editing and it's just too much for me to be honest with you. And currently I'm going around one to two times a week. When I was on a maintenance there was I believe two weeks I didn't go at all. I'm currently still I would say... I'm maintaining, but some weeks I'm losing a little bit, some I'm not. What I'm doing right now is just kind of not, I'm still not on that strict deficit, but I feel like I'm starting to get back on it. Like I can just tell by my eating habits and how much I'm eating, I feel like I'm getting back to the to the deficit mode. Um, but like I said, I'm taking it very casually. I don't want to be hard on myself. I have all winter to do what I got to do. I have all spring. But next summer, I do want to be super, super close to where my goal is and where I kind of want to be. I don't like to put a number on it. I like to see and how I look. And I just want to look a lot more lean. I do think that overall, I do need to drop a good 15 more pounds in total. But again, I need to see what that looks like. Because my body is going to choose where that 15 pounds is going to come off of. So I need to see. And what else was I going to say? I feel like I was going to say something and I kind of... Did I derail there for you guys? I'm sorry. I kind of derail and I'm kind of like very sporadic. It's very Pisces of us. It's actually super sunny today. I love when it's sunny, you guys. It just puts us in such a good mood. And it's been like raining a lot this week. And um, it's so weird looking into the camera and seeing how blonde I am. Like it's very weird. Yeah, and it's supposed to like rain next week. I think I also need some groceries. So I'm going to bring you guys with me to get some groceries. I'm not sure what I want to make. I think I want to do, of course, another what I eat in a day. I love doing those for you guys. And probably another meal prep video because you guys like that one as well. But I'm going to kind of think about what I want to make. I did a pasta recipe that you guys want to see. So I think I might do that one. But I have to do something else. I like to have two meals. 
But anyways, we'll just get a bunch of groceries, a bunch of veggies, probably no fruits because I'm not really a So let's go through the Starbucks drive through again. Um, I like to get my matcha sometimes before the gym because it gives me such a good like hip in my step. And I just get to the gym and I'm just like boom, boom, boom. You know what I'm saying? I'm ready to box someone. No, I'm not ready to box someone. Let's see how this goes. Hi, welcome to Starbucks. How are you doing? Good, how are you? It's Stephanie. Oh, hey. hey. Are you gonna do a green tea latte? I'm gonna do a tall and a grande cup, please. Um, the two stevias, yeah. No problem. Yeah. And that's everything? Yes, and you can do, how many matcha does that one come with? Um, tall would come with two. With two, can I do three of them? Three matchas, okay. Is that everything? Yes. Okay, just drive up, okay? Thank you. Thank you. She always knows my drink. I just recently changed tall to grande, so that's why. Some of them don't know the extra matcha, but yeah. I just want my drink. I feel like my hair falls out like crazy. Do you guys see how I have more blonde at the top here now? Thank goodness. How are you? Good, how are you? Good. Thank no, you. Not. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. Bye. I have my like, what do you call this thing? Like a visor? I have this down because it's so sunny outside, but I have my drink, you guys. They made it so perfect. And they have their Christmas cups. Do you guys see that? Oh my gosh, it's so cute. I got one yesterday, but I got the Venti yesterday. But for the gym, I just like to get a small one. And then, you know, later on, like a Venti wouldn't hurt. You know what I'm saying? DJ name guys help me find a DJ name because I feel like I deserve one like let's just be real oh my god I want to be should I be like DJ Pisces DJ Steph G like no I don't want it to be talky guys come on come up with a good DJ name for me down below please I'm gonna be taking votes and I'm gonna see who is going to win okay guys I need a DJ name I want it to be hella cute though do I even want DJ in front of it because it may I don't know I feel like like DJ like DJ Polly D like I feel like it just makes it tacky help me out guys that's it for today's music I'm gonna head off to the gym and then we're gonna go grocery shopping hope you guys enjoyed my song selections guys how pretty are all these colors when I used to go to college in Oakville I used to drive up ninth line and oh my god the entire drive was pretty much my favorite and it just got me in such a good mood right before school I would definitely say I can handle fall but I can handle it if it's like this like right now it's 9 degrees Celsius and it's been like 13 12 I can handle those temperatures I just can't handle when it starts to go like below I look at the little airplane oh my god I'm like obsessed with airplanes you guys anyways I just want to show you guys how pretty the trees are we are here you guys at Loblaws I'm so excited to do some new recipes for you guys. I think I want to do like a beef taco. Okay guys, so we need to find tortillas. So I found these ones. I wanna make like beef soft tacos, like the ones that I had in Toronto. That's what I'm trying to mimic. Um, and at the beginning of my trip, the employees were like staring at me. So that's why I couldn't really show you guys too much. I was afraid that they were gonna tell me to stop. These ones are 100 calories per two tortillas. How awesome is that? So I think I'm gonna freeze one pack because I have a feeling I'm gonna really like this meal. I'm gonna show you guys what else I got. So I've been really loving these salad packages. They're kind of all ready for you. You just have to mix the uh, sides that they give you. This one is a Mediterranean one. I've never tried this one before, but I've tried the Caesar one. So I picked up one of those and one of the Mediterranean. This I feel is so good when you guys want something quick and I just kind of cook up some um, chicken on the side, some chicken breast, and I have that as like a lunch. Tomatoes, I'm gonna make like a pico de gallo to go on top of the soft tacos cilantro bell peppers for my pasta and of course the red onion for my pasta as well these guys I'm running out of I absolutely love them for breakfast the one buns these are the mini ones and they are a hundred calories which is amazing I use this to dip inside of my egg I love like dipping bread inside of my egg so this is definitely a must-have for me for breakfast I have only one left and what I love about them is that they're already pre-cut for you guys so you just split them and pop them in the toaster 
So I'm gonna be getting this couscous, you guys. I think that this is really good to put inside of your salads. And I've actually tried this with um, cucumber and tomato inside, so I think I'm gonna use it for something. The last sauce I got was this roasted garlic and herb. So I think I'm gonna get this one again for my pasta. So I ran out of my liquid aminos, but the only one they have at Loblaws is the liquid soy, so I'm gonna pick that one up instead. Look what they sell at Loblaws now, you guys. The stevia that I love from Starbucks. This is my ultimate favorite stevia, and I used to just order it on eBay. Now they have it at Loblaws. You can get the 40 packet or you can get the 80 packet. Oh my God, these are the best stevia ever. I've tried so many, and this one is so good. You guys, I cannot help but to come to this side and look how cute this is. Like, I cannot. Like, I just can't. I'm actually getting a bath mat because I'm gonna put this by my bed. I hate when I put my feet down in the morning in the winter and my feet are freezing, so I'm gonna get this one. Okay, these candles down here, like, look how pretty these are. They have, like, a marble effect to them. Okay, I might have to pick one of these up. Maybe it's, like, a side gift. Ooh! Okay, so the last things I got was this white pasta. I got this rotini one to make my pasta then i got the bow tie one this is my absolute favorite this one actually has really good fiber that's why it's made like that i got these two pillowcases because i love having extra pillowcases so i got this from them they're 100 percent cotton then i got this roast i think i'm gonna do like a beef roast with some roasted carrots it's very like fall and winter then I got my beef so I can do my beef tacos I'm so excited to do these tacos you guys I can't even this is gonna taste so good over top oh my god it's only 50 calories per two tablespoons and yeah I already showed you guys that I got this and that's basically it we are ready to go we just finished grocery shopping and that was actually a really good grocery shopping trip i hate when it's like the same thing over and over and over again that i keep getting i do try to change up um, my meals i'm super excited to make those beef tacos those soft ones and i'm really excited to use those corn tortillas because like i said i've never used anything like that before and they're so low calorie you guys two of them are 100 calories i'm like <laughs> girl they know we're about that deficit life you guys before i forget to mention to you guys i have a gift guide yes yeah, so on stephaniemissero.com i've actually created a gift guide for you guys so a 2018 gift guide all these really cute gift ideas if you guys want to check that out there i'm done my christmas shopping you guys yes i finished like october 29th or 30th or something like that this year i decided to do it hella early because i do not like being in stores when it's crazy crazy and i'm a shopaholic like i'm a shopper when it gets like snowy i think it's more the weather than the people i can handle the lineups to be honest with you and i've done it many times last year i did to be honest with you like 80 percent if not all of my shopping online and i find that online because they know people are shopping a lot more online there's more deals um, so I've created a gift guide on there and you guys will notice that some of the items I actually have coupon codes that you guys can use I put the uh, Tristique um, Some of their items so super cute I love their shadow crayon and I have their highlighter stick as well And I have a coupon code for you guys to use to get 20% off They're perfect for stocking stuffers inside gifts sometimes they're the most like exciting out of the entire gift Let's be real um, but yeah, there's a ton of ideas there. I also have some stuff that I listed from Boohoo and I have a coupon code there. Boohoo is amazing because they always have sales going on too. I don't know why I'm holding my tripod. I really don't know. So now I'm just kind of heading home. Um, that was a really good shopping trip. I'm really excited for the recipes that are coming. And yeah, so if you guys want to check out that gift guide and also you guys can shop my favorites I also put my merch there as like a side gift if you guys wanted to get it for someone um, A couple of you guys were asking me if the campaign was still gonna be open for Christmas and I was like of course it is So that's basically it for this video you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed Don't forget of course to give it a big thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell to get notified for all of my newest videos Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see all of my beautiful babes in my next video